Hello, and welcome to another short video from Cato Networks. Today, we will give a short overview of the new Cato Managed SASE offering. Frequently, partners tell Cato, it would be nice if we could... something. That is exactly what we're addressing with our Managed SASE portal and dashboards. As a managed service provider, wouldn't it be nice to have a native dashboard to give an overview of all of your accounts, and even clue you into potential threats? This is the Manage SASE Overview Dashboard. This dashboard gives incredible visibility into your accounts as a whole, subset accounts, or simply as individual accounts. You can drill down on this by account or accounts if you wish, but otherwise it's aggregated data that is displayed. The dashboard provides a lot of information, including current licensing for managed accounts, how many sites are deployed, user counts, and event counts. Aggregated information such as network and security data, events, and risky applications are displayed in easy-to-digest formats. Insights into managed accounts, including risk estimates and open stories from Cato's XDR platform, are also provided. Best practices scores are also displayed, including how closely managed accounts meet Cato's best practices. Information from Cato's experience monitoring is also displayed at a glance. And finally at the bottom, a heat map showing where all deployed sites are located by country. Keeping track of licensing tends to be one of the more challenging tasks for managed service providers. That's why I think you'll like this new dashboard. Clicking on License Inventory displays an overview of licensing for all of your managed accounts. It shows current licensing type, types of bandwidth that are licensed, including pooled or site licenses, and what group and region those licenses apply to. Current licensing for features and user types is also displayed. This section of the dashboard shows the current information on potential white space or upsell for ZTNA, endpoint protection, or other account feature licensing. Scrolling down, individual account licensing details are displayed, including expiration date and current licensing counts for specific Cato features. Again, helping our partners manage their customers' licensing and renewals. Co-branding is one of the most common requests for enhancement that Cato has had, and now Cato is taking co-branding to a whole new level. Partners can change the colors and even the logo in the Cato management application to make it your management application. Co-branding also follows through the warning and block pages, email communications, application portal, and even the Cato client. This gives our partners complete logo control and branding over the entire Cato deployment for their managed customers. If you have any questions, please reach out to your Cato channel manager. Thank you for watching this quick video. We'll see you next time.